everybody it's diane here with a easy project that's turning out kind of cute i made some ahead of time just to make sure i was going to like it i'm calling these journaling cards through the fold over style but they could be gift enclosures mini note cards you could you know bind pages in there these could be covers for mini notebooks cute so anyway i had this idea from journaling planet a youtube channel here i'll link her info in my description area she made an accordion book which is very cool you should go check it out but use color tissue paper in it and diane thought you know i've got color tissue paper that i haven't touched in like a long time i should do something with it so i'm not doing what she did but it was because of her i was thinking of using tissue so i'm giving her credit for this idea so i just have this is heavier printer paper or kind of a well, medium weight cardstock i guess three by five and i just folded them in half and i went went ahead and stamped on tissue paper which if you've never done that before be aware it can seep through to what's below so put a scrap paper under there just in case and right now as you can see I'm looking for something to put in the background. So that's what we're doing with this segment. Background stuff. Text papers looked good under there. Oh, that's okay, but I'm not overly impressed. I'm in the scrapbook paper box here. If you want to be nice and easy and simple, just glue that down and you're done. You certainly could do this any size you want but I had these three by five papers cut already so that's just why I grabbed that I don't have a lot of purple stuff I don't think for some reason that's a, a big color in the scrapbooking world of course I don't like it so much so maybe I just don't buy it I'm not aware of it maybe <laughs> but I had this purple tissue so why not no oh, that's too dark I know why not because you're not gonna find anything to match it no you're not okay there's a little purple spot there this is Easter egg dyed I think it's a drawing paper You could have them open this way too if you want. I think, did I do one that way? I don't remember. Yeah, I think I did the typewriter. Okay. Well, I sort of like that. I think that's going to be enough for that one. Okay. This is neat. Maybe we'll go horizontal for this one. Isn't that a cool stamp? I think that's a cool stamp. A lot of detail there. And I kind of forget I have it because it's on a, you know, a sheet, a collection of sewing stamps. And I hardly ever use sewing stuff anymore, so I forget I have it. It's kind of pretty. Crooked. Well, that's not too bad. Okay. Come here. Okay. Purple. Yeah. <laughs> What about a text thing, maybe? Yeah, that's pretty, isn't it, on the white? That almost looks like an Easter card or tag or something. Yeah, you could punch a hole in the corner and hang these. That would be nice, too. All right. 
white. Let's stick with the white theme. All right, I'm going to leave that like that. Leave that like that. Yeah, I think we'll go horizontal on this one, too. I was thinking, if you could tell from this one, these would be fun for Halloween, too. I thought, do, you know, black ink on orange tissue. Well, that's sort of nice and colorful, considering, you know, this old time bike is kind of a fun look. So I'm going to stay with fun. Let me could do something going the other way. I think that's a little too much with that. Um, let's try this. It's the same colors pretty much as that plaid there. It's very springtime, doesn't it? Okay. Okay, the non-Halloween, but it kind of looks like Halloween flowers here. It's okay. I don't I don't personally like it that much. But if you have this exact stamp and tissue and this old wrapping paper, which I know you all do, go ahead and use it. Okay, why not go fall with the orange? That's nice. Alright, maybe some yellowed looking printing. I know I have some somewhere. <laughs> That'll do it. Okay, lastly, where's the last card? I lost it. Hello card, I don't know, I don't see it. Oh, here it is, no? Okay, we'll just fold the new one. Maybe I only did five. I don't know. Well, now you know how to fold the card in half. You know, that would be cool and stitch around. You can do that too. Um, I'm not going to because like I said, I think I'm using these as journal cards. So I don't want stitching on the inside, which you could uh, cover it with another paper. No, I don't like that. I thought that would be good. No, too similar. Too similar. You're not listening. Um, 
think that's too busy. I like the colors. It it might be okay, but I think with the little the dots and all the detail there, it's too fussy. All right, what about this border? It's okay. It's not overly impressive by any means. Yeah, no. <laughs> I shouldn't make sounds like that. How do you uh, spell that out for closed caption? What we just had. No. No. All right, I'll give it a couple more seconds here, and then I'll find something on my own if I don't and glue down the background stuff and then we will come back and do some additions such as washi tape and where'd they go and ribbon and maybe flowers okay no okay i'm going to find something else on my own I think I want like a second border thing with that. No. All right, come back and we'll decorate. Hang on. Okay, the backgrounds are down. I was just thinking, I do have sewing scrap paper. Some of you may have seen before. You may recognize from previous videos. Um... like the scissors because of the color I'm not sure if they're too big let's see and I hope you know I'll cut this out better later ribbon on the bottom it sounds rhythmic doesn't it? a ribbon on the bottom <laughs> I don't know it just struck me something here very musical or rhythmic or something I don't know Diane are you hungry or tired or something I don't know it just struck me what can I say I'm looking for a flower in case you don't know what I'm doing because you didn't tell us having trouble lately. I have a lot of flower paper, but it seems like every time I'm looking for realistic or this or that, I can't find it. I have to buy more paper. Okay. Ribbon on the bottom. Um, well, number one, these edges are all torn, but as you can see, this one's, you know, angled crooked. I don't like that. I am definitely going to cover that with washi or ribbon or something, unless I put an image there. Any washi handy that would work? I have green. How, would that be just like ridiculously boring? Probably. Yeah. <laughs> you never take our word for anything, Diane. You always have to prove it to yourself. Yeah, I do. Well, once in a while, you're pleasantly surprised, right? 
Well, hokey green hearts aren't really me. No, I don't like it anyway. Okay, good. It was in a set. In case you're wondering, well, why'd you buy it then? It's part of one of these sets. Well, what about turquoise? Well, this isn't really so turquoisey. This is more of a medium blue. Okay. All right, I still need something else with this though. Maybe a bird. Yeah, I grabbed the bird box because we have a feather and then the rest are kind of floral already. So maybe birds. This video is for the birds. Aren't they all? Okay. <laughs> all right. Um, if I don't put an image <laughs> on this side, left side, I think I'm going to add a second washi because it's a little too crooked, but no, um, too much of a solid line or something. I don't know. Okay, but the birds and butterflies. To buy more birds too. No, I <laughs> Okay. This is sort of funky fun. Is it too small? Maybe we could take a couple. Well, all right, here's good colors here. So let's get one on here and then see if we need a second one. Well, we need something. Whether it's another one of these birds. What about the dark one? They're mad at each other. Okay, now they're talking. Okay, I still want a second washi there. I don't, I don't like the way that's. What about pink? No, the stripes are too. Uh, okay, ribbon. You gonna remind me of that? <clears throat> Because I'm not going to remember. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'll surprise everybody and remember. Okay, maybe a butterfly for that. Where was that one here? This purple on here. Well, there's this one and there's that one. I think that one matches too well. If you're rooting for that one, you're right. That would match really well, but I think it's you're not going to see it. Okay. I'm going to leave that for now. That definitely needs, you know, stitch line or something around the edges. That I'll remember. Okay, do we want a bird with the feather there? And I would say a little more of a realistic looking bird. Oh, that's, I think that's too big. 
And if you want to be smart, don't glue all this stuff down ahead of time, but I did. Maybe that. So case in point, I could move the feather over or something if I wanted, but I can't because it's glued down now. And my dog must see a rabbit or something outside. I'm sorry if you hear that. All right, maybe that. Well, an owl. All right, hang on a minute. Yes, it was a rabbit. I found a different paper there with, or a different owl, I should say. I think it looks better. But we want something on top. Well, tomorrow's Easter. Maybe it's the Easter Bunny. Maybe he knows something I don't. <laughs> Okay, um, I think I can use a second piece or something. It It's still, that's kind of low. Okay, I don't know that that's perfect, but it's, for what I have here, it's probably the best. Okay, then that last one. Uh, I don't know that I have much. Yeah, that's okay. Um, we're back to purple, aren't we? Well, you know, we could be very repetitive. Let's just grab this. It's here. Actually, there's a little one under it. Maybe I'll use that, too. See that? All right, before my dog barks again, I'll probably finish these off. I might just add, you know, like I said, ribbon. Was that it? Ribbon on this. Ribbon or stitch line or something on that. Okay, hang on. They'll be back. They'll be back, and I'll be done. <laughs> what does is, what is Willy Wonka say? Wait a minute. Strike that. Reverse it. Okay, hang on. Okay, I'm back, they're done. Or they're back, I'm done. However you want to phrase that. They're cute. This one I wound up with washi tape on the bottom. This one is plain. I like that. You could certainly add stamping, border it. Uh, you could put a ribbon. But I like it like that. And then the two lavender. Okay, well thanks to Journaling Planet for reminding me to use tissue paper. <laughs> I think these are pretty. Okay, thanks everybody. Hope you have a good day.